when the uh, migratory wave started in earnest in the 80s and 90s. It really started, frankly, as a result of, in many ways, as, as you know, Reagan's you know, one landmark immigration act, IRCA, 1986, which we forget some of the key jockeys on that were people like Newt Gingrich, who was supportive of IRCA in 86, and isn't afraid of being to the left of Barack Obama on immigration because he believes in it. And the same thing with, uh, with a Pete Wilson, who became you know, the, uh, the, the demonic figure of the Latino community uh, this was somebody who was driving positive immigration, uh, cha uh, uh, immigration changes at the national level long before uh, the heated rhetoric of the 90s uh, uh, stepped up. The problem was the size and the scope of the immigrant waves that started coming in the 80s and 90s had us as a society and as a government structure at the state and local level buckling, and it needed to be responded to. And the federal government's inability to, to, to take care of the immigration issue since 1986 has exacerbated these racial and social tensions 